What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Dash Reacts and today let's check out another South Park episode from season 18. This is Grounded Vindaloop. Let's do this. Starts with butters. Whoa! What's like on there? I see all our friends at school. If I hold up my hands, I can see them too. Oculus. Whoa! Butters, what the hell are you doing? I feel Stan! He looks totally real! That's awesome, Butters. Yeah, they haven't worked out the audio yet, but it... He's so fucking stupid. <laughs> I'm feeling kind of dizzy and... Uh... Butters, no! Are you crazy? Oh, yeah, then I would spit my neurons and scramble my brains. I forgot! Did you also forget that if you die in virtual reality, you die in real life, Butters? I'm sorry! Mm, huh. That sounds like some Neo in the Matrix type stuff. If you're killed in the Matrix, you die here. The teachers just okay, let them run out of the room. school. All right, Butters, sit down at the computer. Now drop the stupidity window. We're just gonna make it. Stupidity window drop. Welcome back, dude. How do you feel? Do you feel okay? I touched Wendy's boob. <laughs> he took off the shop goggles and he was all like, "Whoa, I'm back!" Damn it, if it's not the awesomest thing ever. This is the security guards of Butter's torture. Uh, I'm not so sure about that. Coup de gras, Cartman. Thank you, Cal. <laughs> Poor Butters. Butters is an asshole, and he deserves to be taken down once in a while, okay? Hey, Eric, he what'd it. you say to the principal for missing first period? I said, well, technically I was at school, but Eric and I know a little something you don't. Right, Eric? These guys are so dumb, huh? Yeah. See? He's an asshole. Fuck him. No, he's just gullible. Stop. Are you absolutely sure you want to do this, Butters? Well, not a hundred percent. Even ten percent is good enough. Here you go. Speaking of that Oculus headset, that was owned by Facebook, right? Which is now Meta. And Meta has poured all kinds of money into virtual reality and the whole concept of the metaverse. But the company is absolutely tanking right now. And my question to you is, do you think this huge gamble on VR in the metaverse is going to pay off for the company? Or is it going to make the company go belly up? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. All right, Butters, I'm booting up the core competency now. Edify framework is on hand. Vital signs appear to be normal. Interim status? Interim status is go! Mark. It's just playing. It worked! Dude. I'm back in! All systems normal! Everything looks good, Butters. You're doing great. Let's get to work. Okay! Just starts eating chips, man. How much more of this am I supposed to clear up? Almost done with this level, Butters. Just make sure you've cleared the driveway and uh, walkway of all the virtual snow. It's so That's realistic! Tough. The snow looks kind of fake, though. There's an old fat lady here. She's holding out money for me. Yeah, take the money, Butters. You got the money? Okay, great, Butters. Now get back to the access point. I hate to say it because it's wrong what he's doing to Butters, but at the same time, it's kind of smart, though. He's got work to get done, but he doesn't have to do it himself. I kind of wonder if Cartman would be good at running a business. There's just one thing I gotta do real quick. There you are, mister. Just what do you think you're Hello, doing? Hello, Dad. It's me, Butters. I know that. What but do you... This is for all the times I got grounded. Oh! 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 oh. Ha, I can almost feel his bowels on my fist! Ha! I feel amazing! <laughs> I'm back outside now! I'm a bad man! You hear me? <laughs> and take out your stupid car! But it's, it's uh, time to stop. Get back to my place. I'm gonna take his car! This is like Grand Theft Auto! Oh no! I'm in the car now! Oh shit! Oh, that's cool. There's a prostitute out here. I'm gonna beat her up and take her money. Wait, hang on, no, buddy. Take is... that, you damn hooker. What you doing, motherfucker? <laughs> I'm taking your money. But the hooker stabbed me. I can't breathe too good. I can't see. Are you what? still there? I think I overdid it. What the hell is that? Butters? <laughs> Butters? <laughs> what? Oh, no. You're very lucky, young man. You've got a couple hairline fractures, but the knife missed your spleen by half an inch. Your dad wanted me to let you know that you're grounded more than you can possibly imagine. Ah, oh, nuts. <laughs> Try and relax, and when your parents get here, we'll sort this all out. That's one of the dangers of the virtual world, of the gaming world, or just the internet, period. Right, when you can hide behind an avatar, sometimes you'll do and say things that you normally wouldn't in the real world. Try and relax, and when your parents get here, we'll sort this all out. Wonder how long I'm grounded for. Forever. You've become trapped in the simulation. None of this Morpheus. is real. I told you never to take the headset off outside the access point, didn't I? I'm talking to you as a computer program. That's why I can manipulate reality. <laughs> what? Ah, okay, stop, stop. The Oculus Compromise has been streamlined. You can't trust anyone in this reality. Say nothing to no one about the Oculus Rift. 
I'm gonna get you back to reality, Butters, but you have to give me time. I've gotta go. The Orion parameters are embellishing. Oh, my Well, goodness. are you happy, Cartman? Butters is completely traumatized. I'm happy that I totally got away with it. What's a 911 area code? Hello? Hello, Eric. My name is Steve from Oculus Customer Service. There oh, seems no. to be an error with our virtual headsets. There's been a malfunction with the headset you ordered from us. Right now, you're actually in your room at your computer wearing an Oculus headset, but you're in a coma-like trance, my friend. Fuck you. I understand your shock, my friend. But you have simply been in the virtual world so long, you have forgotten. Uh-huh. Because I thought I was messing with butters, but I'm actually the one trapped in virtual reality. So the Indian customer service is where the Vindaloop in the title comes from, right? The people you are talking to are just computer programs, my friend. Tell them you're not computer programs. Maybe we are. Oh. <sighs> Kyle, just don't be a dick right now. You really think I'm that stupid? That I'd believe all of this all along has been me living out some kind of virtual reality fantasy? Fuck you! Eric, poopsikins. Eric? Oh. Honey, it... maybe that's enough computer time. It's been about 19 hours now. The I Twitch. know you said not to disturb you with your new toy, but Mommy thought maybe you needed to eat. All right, I'll just leave it here, hon. I'm turning oh, in for wow. the night. Mommy loves you. Wait. It, huh? What kind of person did we raise you to be? Oh, you think no. this world is just there for your amusement? You are not allowed to use the phone or computer. Please, you can't do that. Oh, no, mister. You are grounded. <laughs> Mr. Statch. Are you fucking with me? What do you mean? Butters, I'm seriously, are you fucking with me? Butters, I talked to Oculus customer service, and they said I'm the one who's wearing a headset and has forgotten he's in virtual reality. Oh, really? Okay. Oh, that's a relief. Oh, it's a relief, huh? That means you're nothing but a computer program. Oh, God. That's right. Oh, God. That's right. <laughs> now, you better stop messing around, Butters, so I can help you out of this. You know how I said if you die in virtual reality, you die in real life? Yeah. Well, if you get grounded in virtual reality, you get grounded in real life, too. Forever. Kyle, it's Butters. I've been grounded. No, no, you don't understand. This time, I've been grounded for no good reason. I didn't do anything, Kyle. Uh-huh. I think there's something supernatural going on. I asked my dad why I was being grounded, and he said that for asking him, that I was more grounded. It doesn't make sense. <laughs> yeah, it does. For parents. Go to Carmen's house. I think the answer might be with the... the... Uh, who is that? <laughs> Come check this out. You think he's somehow trapped in virtual reality? Oh, fuck you! <laughs> Get up, Cartman. What? Okay, then let's take him to the hospital. Fuck you if you're in on this. In on what? Oh, fuck you. <laughs> Nobody trusts anybody. Thank you for calling Korean Airlines customer service. Help all your local customer service. This is Steve. Yeah, our friend has been missing for a few days, so we went and checked on him, and he's in a coma wearing your headset. That this car may be recorded to help with better customer service in the future. The headsets we sold you are having some minor problems. We are trying to locate all the headsets and do a recall. Do you understand? It is a total recall. Uh. Fuck you. Have you seen the movie Total Recall with Arnold Schwarzenegger? If you haven't, what are you doing? Please watch it. It is a total recall. His eyes. Fuck you. Did I take care of all your customer needs in a timely and satisfactory fashion today? You haven't done anything yet. We need help. Our friend is in a coma. Put on the Oculus headset and go into the virtual world and convince your friend to get to an access point. Mm. This is cool. Hey, Cartman. I need to talk to you. I know. Let's go to the backyard. Cartman, you aren't really here. And why do you know that, Cal? Customer service said that one of us needed to put on the headset and come get you, and that's why I'm here. Of all the people to send in to go and get Cartman out, why would you send Kyle? Like, isn't Kyle the one that Cartman hates the most, trust the least? Like, why didn't you send Stan or, or even Kenny? Calm down. No! I put your headset on and came here to- In virtual reality, yes, you did. You've been in the virtual space all right. along, Kyle. We're arch rivals. Why would the guy send you in to convince me of anything? Right, right, right! Fuck you! Minute. Why would they send you in to convince me of anything? Fuck! This is deep. <laughs> Can you tell me if I purchased an Oculus Rift headset there? Or if you sold one to an Eric Cartman? Best Buy customer service, this is Steve. The loop. Dude, what? No dinner for you! 
While you're grounded, you can just go to bed hungry! Do you remember why Butters is grounded? What what did he do? Is this my virtual reality or Carmen's virtual reality? Wait, it's neither. Wait. I know this might be hard for you to grasp right now. We've all been here from the beginning, taking turns on the Oculus Rift headset. This is virtual reality. How do you know? Because I'm a computer program. I'm not real. He's lying. I'm not lying. Go ahead and ask customer service. What was the name of the person who first called you for customer service? That I can't answer. His name was Butters. Butters called customer Butters? service first? This is Steve with customer service? Uh, no, 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 my friend. I am Steve with customer service. A customer who is in virtual reality called customer service and it has created a customer feedback loop. Here uh -huh. in India, we call it a customer feedback window loop. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, fuck you. No, 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 do not fuck me because I am you and then we will just be <laughs> fucking ourselves. <laughs> now, have I provided answers to your questions in a courteous and prompt fashion? Listen, listen, if I didn't answer your questions, then we have given bad customer service. Whoa, 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 okay. I'm trying to, let's just keep going, let's just keep going. You didn't answer any of my questions! Well, what is more important, my friend, the result or good customer service? The result? You guys can't be here. Why not? Because I'm grounded. That means no visitors. Butters, when did you call Oculus Rift customer service? When we were playing with the Oculus headset. Don't you guys remember? I played with it first and went a little nuts. I forgot I was in virtual reality and I got grounded and now I'm grounded in real life. So now we are in the real world. Yes. You guys. Are you? I have are... accepted the reality that I am just a computer program. One of us right now is in a room wearing a VR headset seeing all this and it's not me. Butters! Ah! What are your friends doing here? Listen carefully, my friend. You are stuck in a paradox. There are three things you cannot do in virtual reality. You cannot okay. die, you cannot get grounded, and you cannot call customer service. This is why uh, you're having problems. There is only one thing that matters. What? Have I answered your question satisfactorily and offered good <laughs> customer service? That doesn't make sense. That's the paradox. Please, my friend, please. I am not real. You are not real. This call may be recorded. But you're getting it now. Oh, no. The belt. I am pleased with the customer service I've been provided! Oh! Are you there? Okay. We're right here, dude. You remember now? Yeah, I remember. I'm heading back to the access point. Butters, he's not grounded anymore. He's not? No, I I've got to tell him. You can go outside and play, son. Y you mean, I'm not grounded? No. It's over. They did it! They figured it out! Whoopee! We're here, dude. Just a little further and we can finally end this. All right, Stan, just sit down at the computer. All right, dude, take off the headset. Oh! <laughs> so, aside from all the bullcrap, what do you think of the Oculus? It's pretty cool, but the yeah, graphics real. suck. Fellas, I'm not grounded anymore. Butters. For the ending alone with the real kids, that episode was totally worth it. But the story behind this episode was fantastic. To me, it was almost like The Matrix meets Total Recall meets Inception. It was the story of multiple never-ending loops. And then it was insanely creative to end the episode by making the whole South Park world the simulation. My brain is still processing this episode, so I know I'm gonna have to go back and watch it again. But let me know your thoughts in the comments. This was an excellent recommendation. If you enjoyed this reaction, please make sure to give this video a like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.